the moves. I just if you're in the way, then good luck to you. So. Get off the tracks yeah. while the train's on there. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's the, the potential for this Buckeyes offense? I mean, you guys have been putting up points like it's nothing. Oh, potential is big, you know. Um, we, got, we, got, we got a lot more to work on. You know, we, we, we're never satisfied where we're at, but, um, you know, we're proud of what we did today. And, you know, we just got to get back in the, uh, the, the film room and see what we can do better. And then Justin Fields, um, ha obviously he's been lighting it up ever since he's taken the starting job. How would you describe his play so far? Uh, he's a great player, you know. He, like him, he's, he's improving each week, and uh, I'm, just, I'm just looking forward to seeing what, uh, you know, he's going to continue to do throughout the season. Master, what do you think of the things you've been able to do from the start of the season to now to just <laughs> keep getting better, keep having bigger games each week? Yeah, uh, just, you know, with the experience, you know, gaining experience, I think I'll get better and better, and, you know, uh, it's all about – practicing hard too so you know if you continue to practice hard and, and see that, that it's important to do that during throughout the week and it's going to show up on, on game day so yeah. does it help when JK goes out there and have that kind of success and then kind of sets the stage for you to come in and do the same you know uh, we have a thing at Ohio State called competitive excellence so you know the next guy up has got to be just as good as the first guy so you know I appreciate uh, look, you know I look up to JK and he's a great guy and you know when I get in there I just want to do my best for the team how much what was it like here in, uh, in the offseason? I assume you heard it. Coach Day told us multiple times you know, he really wanted somebody to step up as the second running back. I mean, is that a message that was delivered to you? And what's it like when you hear something like that? Uh, of course. You know, I, I know I had an opportunity and I had a, uh, you know, uh, feel like a responsibility, you know, to, to you know, to come out and, and step up for the team. And, you know, I was kind of down a little bit during fall camp when I wasn't, you know, able to be out there with the team. But, you know, like I said, I just kept a good mindset, good positive thinking, you know, thinking, uh, trusting in the Lord. You know, um, <clears throat> still got a long way to go, but, you know, I'm proud to be out here helping out. What did the offensive line do well today to allow you and JK to have the success you both did? Oh, they did great. You know, uh, I just, you know, just like I said, in practice, you know, we, we work and work and work and, you know, they grind it out and, <clears throat> I just feel like they, they, you know, they did what they were supposed to, and they opened up holes, and there were some things I could have did better. You know, things I always got to work on, but I just feel like, you know, I, I just really appreciate them. We couldn't do it without them. So, Master, I'm sorry. Were you aware? Thank you very much. Were you, were Folks, we you have Coach Wilson over here. What JK did here two years ago, kind of break out. Uh, no, uh, actually, I did. I think I do remember uh, watching that game, but I'm not sure the exact statistics. But uh, I know he did well. To to come in and kind of have your breakout game similarly, same venue working with him, what could that kind of mean for you guys in the relationship? I mean, you know, you know, I'm just, like, so far, you know, I've just been trying to gain trust in my, my uh, teammates, and, you know, it's, it's going well right now, and I just got to continue to do that. And, I, like I said, I look up to J.K. He's a great guy, and, you know, I, I just want to learn as much as I can from him while he's here.